best way to create subtitles or captions in After Effects or Premiere Pro or your money back. Plus, you will get a free script. Create subtitles or captions to your video is always boring. And that's why I want to show you the best way to you do it. There are some scripts out there with interesting solutions, but the problem to me is not the tool, but the workflow. And that's why I will explain to you this method in three steps. Transcription. There is no secret in transcription if your video is short or if you have the script, but very often your video is too long. Or worst, it must be translated to another language. Today we have sites like Fiverr and Upwork where you can find professionals that will translate and transcript for you your video with very reasonable price, something like 50 cents per minute of transcription. Ô oh, Lucas, tem três reais? Tenta a moeda. Pode ser moeda. Pega pra mim? Eu quero fazer uma transcrição. Três reais, é. Obrigado. So make sure if it's the best use of your time or if it's better to outsource. With the transcription in hand, I like to save it to the most basic text editor that you may have. Notepad on PC is a good choice or the text editor in Mac OS. In this way, you can have the text pure without any formatting. Bye. Let's understand the timing. Import the video that you want to put the subtitles into the After Effects and use it to create a new composition. Create a text layer to put your subtitle, but don't worry about formatting now. With your text layer selected, now it's time to make an audio preview. You can do that hitting the dot on your numeric keypad. Now you will add a marker to each new phrase of your subtitle. To do that, you can hit the asterisk on your numeric keypad. Don't worry if you miss timing, because you will be able to adjust it later. Let's come back to the text editor. And now we will add the character backslash, always before a line break. And if you want some time without any subtitle, just add two backslashes. I use the character backslash because I think you will not use this character on your subtitle text. But if you use it, you can change it later to another character. This character will be used to split the text in the After Effects. I will explain to you it later. Now select all the text, copy it and let's go to the After Effects. Subtitle. Paste the text to your text layer. Now it's time to add an expression to your text layer. This expression does two things. First, it will split your text every time it finds the special character that we add to it. And then it will assign every little part of your text to a marker in your text layer. If you want to better understand this expression, I wrote an article in the Two Dead Frogs blog and the link is on the description. To make this process even faster, I created a script that applies this expression to your text layer just with one click. So you can download the script in the link below and then install in your After Effects by copying the file to your script folder. Now that you have the script, just select your text layer and hit subtitle. Now you can customize the visual of your text layer as you want. And that's all. If you need to adjust timing, just click and drag in the marker. If you need to modify something, do it in the notepad and then pass the text again in your text layer. And if you need to use another special character to split your text, change it in the script. If you don't want to use this script, no problem. Just go to the article, copy the expression and apply it to the source of your text layer. The result will be the same. But remember, both the script and the expression will only work if you follow this workflow that I showed you. Workflow in 
Premiere Pro. If you are working in the Premiere Pro, I suggest you an adaptation of this workflow. You can create the markers in an adjustment layer directly on the Premiere using the letter M to create them. All you have to do now is copy this adjustment layer and paste it in the After Effects. To copy the markers to your text layer, you can use a free script called Copy Markers or you can do it manually using shortcuts. Use the letter key to go to the next marker and with your text layer selected, hit the letter asterisk from the numeric keypad. Just repeat it several times and you can do it very fast. To use the subtitle in the Premiere Pro, just import the After Effects project to your sequence. This is the simpler and the faster way that I know to create subtitles to your videos. I'm working now in a way to import and export the subtitle to SRT files. In this way, you will be able to use the subtitles on your YouTube videos, for example. Share with me what you think about this technique. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Two, three, four.